Hi, I'm Steve at the Carmichael Workshop. Today I'm going to make a birdhouse that looks like a Rubik's Cube. I'm making this birdhouse out of a regular 6 foot pine 1 by 10. And to get started, I'm going to tilt the blade on my table saw to 45 degrees and then cut 6 9 inch squares that have bevels on all four sides. Birds are kind of picky about the size of the birdhouse and the entry hole it has. So it's a good idea to do some research and find out what kind of birds are in your area and look up what size birdhouse would be suitable for them. Uh, for bluebirds, I'm going to drill a one and a half inch hole into the front piece of the birdhouse and then I'm going to glue together the four sides and the top. I'm going to cut a short piece of this 1x2 to glue across the bottom opening and that will give me something to screw the bottom onto. I don't think the birds will mind if this is underneath them, they'll just build the nest on top of it. I'm going to round over the corners of the birdhouse using my trim router with an 8 inch roundover bit with a guide bearing installed. I'm setting my fence to three inches from the blade so that I can cut grooves on all sides of the box so it'll look like it's made up of blocks. I'm going to use this soft gator zip sander to round over the edges of all of those grooves I cut into the sides and then I'm going to paint it with all of the colors of the Rubik's Cube. I like to drill small drainage holes in the bottom of birdhouses in case the inside gets wet and to also allow for some airflow. So I'm going to drill these small holes inside the grooves of the bottom piece and I'm also going to drill one hole in the center so that I can screw it onto the birdhouse. To make it look just like a Rubik's Cube, I'm going to mask off the grooves and corners and paint those black. And then I'm going to print out the Rubik's Cube logo on a label and stick it on the center of the white side. Well, here it is, the finished Rubik's Cube birdhouse. <laughs> I think it turned out looking pretty cool. I even made a little triangle stand for it. And I doubt I will put it outside. It'll probably just end up up there on the shelf with my other crazy birdhouses. I'll put a link to a playlist up here so you can watch those videos as well. 
If you like this project, please click that like button, leave me a comment below, let me know what you think. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and click that notification bell so you'll see my other future projects. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.